What is the difference between a web browser and a search engine? We created a video on web browsers and I suggest you go see that one after this. But basically, a web browser is a program that lets you view web pages. When you want to go onto the internet, click on a save web page on your computer or click on a link. The first thing that happens is the web browser from your program is opened. There are many different web browsers that people prefer to use for various reasons. But some of the most popular are Apple Safari, Microsoft Edge, Mozilla Firefox, and Google. And the last one is one of the main reasons people struggle to tell the difference between a web browser and a search engine. You see, it's not actually Google that is the web browser, but it's a program called Chrome, which is created by the Google company. So it's called Google Chrome. But a lot of people just say open Google when opening the program called Chrome. But don't get confused. Google is not a web browser. Chrome is the web browser. Google could be referring to the company or Google can refer to the search engine. Now a search engine is a program that searches for and identifies items in a database that corresponds to keywords or characters specified by the user, used especially for finding particular sites on the World Wide Web. The sites that they find that match the keywords are called hits. As you can see, if you search on a particular topic like eggs, you can find millions and millions of hits. And to think, search engines only search a very small percentage of the whole internet. Yes, that's right. So that means there is even more possible sites that match your keywords on places like the dark or deep web. But how does a search engine do the searching? Firstly, it starts with the concept of indexing. Search engines have gigantic databases called indexes, where they keep track of information about web pages. Like what is the topic of the website, what words are being used in the site, and how recently it was updated. Now imagine tiny robots called spiders crawling through the web, exploring and collecting information from web pages. That's what search engines do to keep their indexes up to date. Search engines also use complex algorithms to decide which web pages are most relevant to your search. They consider factors like keywords, relevance, and website quality. This determines if your website will be near the top of the first page or only placed on the fifth page of its search results. Check out our video on search engine optimization or SEO to learn more about what these crawling spiders are looking for and information that the algorithm uses. Search engines also provide a friendly, easy to use user interface. The search engine companies want to make it easy for you to find exactly what you're looking for. There is a search bar that simply lets you type in your queries, but it can do so much more. There are special keywords that you can use to find out things like the weather in New York, or if you need to make use of a calculator to do a calculation, or if you need to find out what a word means, like lollygag. If you want to learn about these keywords, then check out these Google Tips and Tricks videos, or you can download the useful reference guide. The links for these will be in the video description. Now, web browsers are very different. They allow you to view web pages whether they are saved locally on your computer or mostly when you want to view the web page on the internet. You view all sorts of web pages in a web browser. Some of these web pages just happen to be a search engine's web page. Most of the time, you don't actually know the address of the web page you're looking for or even what possible web page options are available. So we open up our web browser program and then you visit the search engine website. You give the keywords and it finds a couple of hits for you. You then click on the link to view the found web pages. So basically, you are using a web browser to view the search engine and then the search engine should suggest other web pages and you continue to use the web browser to view those suggested ones too. Web browsers are the tool you use to view web pages. Search engines are one type of web page that you use to find other web pages. One of the reasons we get confused about them is your web browser has a search setting. You tell the web browser to use a default search engine when searching for websites. So instead of typing the web address or the URL in the web browser's address bar, we can also type in what we are looking for, like you would on a search engine. But it's not the web browser that's doing the searching. All it is doing is using those words, send them to your default search engine website and showing you the results. The search feature of your web browser is simply helping you to avoid the extra step of having to go directly to the search engine web page first and then type in your keywords. To learn more about web browsers and other features, remember to check out that video I mentioned earlier. Hopefully, you now understand the difference between a search engine and a web browser. A web browser lets you view web pages. One of those web pages happens to be a search engine's web page. When you give a search engine keywords, it finds other pages for you to view, which you are all doing with your web browser. Now go use your search engine to search for more Mr. Long videos to help you learn more.
You can find those videos on our YouTube channel at Mr. Long Computer Terms. Also follow us on TikTok at Mr. Long Education and computer programming and literacy videos are on our YouTube channel at Mr. Long IT and Cat. And remember, don't do it the long way, do it the Mr. Long way.